Before I start this video, I just want to say to y'all, Merry Christmas, and if I don't get an episode out before that, Happy New Year. And that should be the Grand Tree completed. I really want to... Shut the fuck up, Game Um... Uh, come on, there we go. Um, I really want to get this episode full of quest completion, and... Knowing myself, I'm not going to do that, but I'm gonna try. So, that's the first clip. Oh shit, 44 attack, awesome. I want to get 60 so I can wear actually the Dragon X. And this should be the Shades of Morton quests. Damn, I never knew this could be this annoying. So this should be the end of the quest making history. And after this one, um, there we go. Did I level up? No, um, I'm gonna do underground pass. Oh man, this is gonna be a shit, this shit quest. Oh. Probably gonna record some of the quests when I like try and jump over those gaps. <laughs> oh man, I'm so boned for that. Also, um, 104 quest points. Nice. Yo, um, I looked up the requirements for underground pass and I already started it. But they said in the guide that uh, you are very m highly recommended to have 50 teething for a shortcut, so I quickly got that. I still need to have like uh, two pickpockets, um, oh, two more, and oh fucking hell, <laughs> teething is so fucking bad. Um, it took me a while to get this though because teething is stupid. But there we go, 50. So right now I am actually going to complete the underground pass. Right here in the middle of the underground pass quest. I need to put this in. This is where you kill that unicorn. Oh man. This is for my girlfriend by the way. If she watched this she's gonna be so wet. Because she really likes unicorns. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. I heard something breaking. Whoops. <clears throat> yeah. Here it starts. Let's just try it. Peace and fuck fail. Oh my god, I did it. Yes. And I still have to go like a lot of the jumps. This is gonna be a pain. And this is underground pass completed this quest. I, I actually fell like three times only. That was... Okay. Um, so now it's uh, waiting... Uh, wait time for... Oh shit, noise. Uh, now it's waiting time for the regicide quest, but in the meantime I'm gonna do another quest. And this should be the end of uh, what lies below. 8k runecrafting experience. Oh, fucking nice. 40 runecrafting, 4 more and I can actually start to grind towards 99 runecrafting. Awesome. I don't know which quest is going to be the next one. Uh, maybe like Tears of Guttics because it's a mini game. Uh, 90 f okay, 49 crafting and spending would be an advantage. Shit. Well, I'll see. And this should be the end of, there we go, Fairy Tales Part 1. And that's my very first farming experience. And I get 17. Awesome. 23 till uh, 18. Yeah. I think the next one will be a Forgettable Tale because, or Fight Arena. Um, forgettable Tale gives me more farming experience. If I am correct, I should be drink that beer, eat that kebab. Oh yeah, just partying hard here in RuneScape. Oh my god. So at last, oh man, what the fuck? This previous clip was so stupid. There we go, 5,000 farming experience. Boom, 25 for me. I can now plant roots plants. Ooh yeah, 44 cooking. Um. Oh man, I don't like this one. Um, next one is probably gonna be Garden of Tranquility, but I don't really know yet. What? Once I pickpocket him once, there we go, Creature of Frankenstein completed. I get the Ring of Carols, two quest points, and 1000 thieving experience. I need to do this quest in order to complete the Garden of Tranquility quest. And it should be the end of the Garden of Tranquility quest. Um, I think right now, 5k farming experience, 5 guam seeds and an acorn, apple tree seed. Nice. Uh, 30 farming. Yeah, I can actually start doing some farming myself, like planting willow seeds. Actually gonna do that. So, the farming grind begins. Oh yeah, by the way, guys. Um, 
Since the, since the completion of uh, some quests that uh, raised my farming, I actually got a thousand total level. I kind of missed that because of uh, the quests, didn't really pay attention. But thousand total level, that's also a very nice milestone. Now let's go to max! And that should be the end of the feud quest. And yeah, I don't know. I, re I really don't know what quest will be next. Come on, fucking finish the quest already! Oh my god, um, probably like, no, I'm, I'm there we go, uh, 15k teething experience, did I level? I did level 51, nice, uh, got a bronze pickaxe for no reason, uh, next one will probably be fight arena or the fermenic trials or isle, well isle I can't really do, but, oh, I really cannot do this one, <laughs> trials, do I need to have... No, I don't need to have this quest completed. Okay, the next one will be Fight Arena or Fermentic Trials. And this should be the end of Fight Arena. Very good. That is... Let me see, 47 attack, just like I predicted. And that's it. So now I'm going to go complete Ferment Fermentic Trials. So this should be the end of Fermentic Trials quest. Three quest points. I have now 124 quest points. I really like that. I think this is like the most I've ever gotten. I got strength level, the defense level, fishing level, uh, crafting level, uh, a woodcutting level. Okay, uh, and that should be it. Awesome. And I really don't know what my next quest is going to be. I'm probably gonna trade to five construction. I know I need to trade in construction. Um. Five construction to get the, the eyes of the glorified, of glorified, uh, glue free. Wow. Um, maybe eagle speak or pff, just some random, random quest. I don't know. And this is sheep herder quest completed. Four quest points. Wow. Uh, very easy quest. A little annoying with the sheep, but never mind. Um. I started doing Zorge Flag, um, Zogre Flesh Eaters, but uh, I'm at the end, like I need to kill that uh, boss level 111 thingy, but I'm just too weak for that, uh, didn't die or anything, but just it, it disappears and I don't kill it in time, so I have to train a little bit like with Slay or something, but I'm gonna keep going with the quests. And because I wanted to complete the quest between a rock, I had to get 50 smithing. Oh man, did it all with cannonballs. It was a little grind, but it didn't lose me any money, it actually made me some money. So next up is Between a Rock and then... Not get me... No, no. Darkness of the Hallow Veil, probably. I don't know. Oh my god, that's a treasure, no. And since I got 50 smithing, I also thought it would be cool to get 50 cooking. Because it's getting quite late here. Uh, it's 2 a.m. and... Like, or like a quarter to two, no, ten minutes till uh, two a.m. Um, yeah, and I don't feel, really feel like doing a quest right now. It's getting quite late. Uh, tomorrow morning I should be doing a farm run, and I'm probably going to get my crafting up for one level more, um, and do fifty f fishing or something, or start with construction or do some hunter. I don't really know. Just some fast or, or slash AFK able skills. Forty crafting. So after a couple of minutes I actually got 16 construction and this gives me access to a couple of more quests such as the eyes of the glorified and I don't know any other but that means that I have now no longer any skills level 1 and um, this was also in there well done you've reached at least level 10 in all skills um, um 1051 total uh, level and a 3.4 million total experience and tomorrow I'm gonna go ahead and continue with all the quests. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. So sorry guys, um, my clips actually got kind of fucked up. Um, today I started off with completing the Between a Rock quest and uh, I also did Where is it? Eagle Speak and I just finished the Family Crest quest and I got my gloves imbued to a cooking gauntlet. Um, sorry for that, uh, that I don't have the clips of me uh, finishing those quests. And that's 50 fishing. And right now I'm getting 34 construction, which is the highest construction level you need for quests. And now I'm going to complete, let's see, uh, Cold War. 
As you guys can see, that was a Cold War quest. Give me 2k fortnite uh, crafting experience, 5k agility, and 1.5k construction. And it gave me a uh, agility level. Nice. And this is recruitment drive completed. Easy quest, fast, a little bit annoying if you mess up, but never mind. I got a initiate salad. And this should be the end of Olaf's quest. Fucking annoying quest. And this should be the last quest of the episode, observatory quest. I'm gonna continue on my grind for uh, for the quest cave, but today is Christmas day, or like Christmas Eve day. And I still have to do a lot of shit for my uh, family, like get food and stuff. And yeah, I will lose a uh, grind of a big day for uh, progress and stuff. But yeah, um, I'll see what I can do.